What is going on everyone? Today we are doing an unboxing and this one is going to be pretty special since this is the very first unboxing in the brand new 416 Dentistry Studio here in Toronto. We're actually currently standing in the lounge of the brand new location and as you can see we are still under construction but everything's starting to come together and it's starting to look amazing. As you know, 416 Dentistry is all about technology. So we have a good unboxing here for you today. We're gonna to be unboxing and assembling a brand new iTero Element 2. Intra oral scanners, or iOS for short, are able to elevate patient care and it's a game-changing tool for the modern dentist. An iOS allows us to create 3D renderings of patients' teeth. Some of the uses include for diagnoses. For example, we can track wear or even movement of teeth using the time-lapse feature. Orthodontic treatment using clear aligners, i.e. Invisalign in order to align teeth. And for restorative dentistry like crown and bridge, so we don't have to take those goopy, messy impressions anymore. In a future video, the 416 Dentistry team will be sharing with you more information about iOS technology. But today, let's get right into this. And since it may take a while to assemble the iTero Element 2, we're going to speed up parts of the video so you don't have to watch me struggling for too long. So let's get right into it. So the iTero Element 2 comes in two boxes. One smaller box here, and then another bigger box that it's sitting on right now. I'm going to maybe zoom out so that you can see a big picture, so that when we're assembling this, you can see all the components involved. So give me a second. As I was mentioning, there are two boxes, one smaller box and then one bigger box. I guess the smaller box has the touch screen and the wand, it says right there, and then the bigger box has the wheel stand uh, that the wand and touch screen sits on. Let's move the uh, touch screen box to the side. And then uh, let's put this uh, puppy down. It's actually pretty heavy. And let's open this up. So let's open up this box. There you go. So that's the wheel stand uh, cover right there. Let's move that off to the side. And now we have everything neatly organized in the box here. So uh, we have some instructions. I probably should read that. Um, it's interesting. It comes in one of these things you can get on like staples. Uh, so here is there, and this um, is the wheels. Put that off to the side here, and then we have scan sleeves in here, webcam here, Logitech webcam, and let's take this off here. Uh, lots of packaging, lots of packaging, and then, oh, this thing's heavy. Let's take this off here. All right. Oh, and then we have a few Allen keys here. So I'm gonna move this box off to this side here. I don't know if any of this is really in frame. Uh, I'm gonna move this over so that we can all see what we're doing here. So there's a couple Allen keys here. So we're gonna need that, seems like. And then we're gonna move that off to the side. And let's open up this bag. Here. Alright, that's actually really, really smooth. Uh, Alright, probably should look at these instructions. Oh, it's nice and laminated here. Alright, so. Um, we got the wheels, we got the stand, so we're supposed to stand, okay, so we're supposed to open this here. Alright, yeah, this thing is pretty damn heavy. It says that we should have two people doing this, and I hope I can do it with just myself. Okay, so we're gonna lift 
this up here. Put that right on here. Sweet. And then now I'm gonna tilt this over. Let's see. This will work. I do that. There we go. Now use the large, the large Allen key. off right here. Let's put that off to the side here. And then 
There's some sort of battery that we're supposed to put in. There's some sort of battery here. So let's put that on this side. I think the battery was underneath here. This thing's heavy. I think this is the battery right there. Yeah. There we go. So what do we do? What do we do? Flip this over. The battery in, so this isn't a big zip lock. Right? So let's put it right here. All right, let's flip this, this guy over here, and then unscrew this here. Take this battery. The battery that goes right into the back here, it's pretty hefty. Let's pop that in. Go this way or the other way? We'll find out. Here we go. You see thumb screws here. That you tighten. Okay. Now let's put that back where the battery was so we don't miss that cover plate. Next. Mount this puppy on the front there. So let's take this screen, which is pretty damn heavy, and it's a little intimidating. So let's put this. supposed to plug something in so yes assembling an Itero and you're looking for this cable, this DC cable that's supposed to, I guess, power the uh, the monitor here, it's literally attached to the backside here. So don't make the same mistake I did. So uh, take that here, sweet. And then now we just plug this in. Let's figure out the orientation of this. It has four circles. Just going like this. Go. That's plugged in. Put the face plate back. It's oh, it's magnetic. That's so cool. I don't know. I love magnets. And uh, I have to put the camera, the wand. Ooh, that's so cool. It's in like this. Barrier off. Let's put this on here. Let's unzip tie this here. And what am I doing? Uh, we're gonna plug this in here. Done. Plug the thing in the back. 
everybody. That wasn't too bad. And you could do this with just one person. If I could do it, you could do it. But be careful, the monitor is pretty heavy, so uh, it wouldn't be a bad idea having two people. But uh, it is what it is. Short staff here. What are you gonna do? So take the power cable. And there you go guys, I set up a brand new Itero Element 2. Uh, we unboxed it, we assembled it, and we're ready to start it up and go through the setup phase. And we're ready to use this with our patients in order to capture 3D renderings of their smile. Thanks again for watching this unboxing. I hope you uh, enjoyed it, I hope you learned something, uh, and we'll see you at the next one. Peace.